taking out a fluffy jumper. It's really cute and snuggly. Like I'm hugging a bear. Hey guys, and today I am here to show you some things. Yeah, this is an October haul. It's the middle of October, so I thought I'd do it now rather than the end of October. Anyway. I have a bit of a sore throat, so bear with me guys. So I bought this from, where did I get this from? Oh yeah, H&M. I like the fact that it's green and very autumnal and it says Daydreamer on it. I'm, all, I'm always daydreaming about stuff, so there we go. And then one of my pa favourite Paramore songs is Daydreaming. One thing I really, really like about this top is the fact that it's long sleeves and it's a crop top, so I can wear it with my high waist jeans and not get cold arms. <laughs> I really love the colour, that's what really got me to purchase it and try it on. Yeah. New top, guys. I've been to Yankee Candle, or Aroma, as they have in... Leicester. I like the fact that they wrap it, or well, my shop, wrap it in this nice paper to keep it secure. So the first one I wanted to get was the Berry Trifle. My friend Scarlett really recommended this one to me. This one is called Red Apple Wreath, so perfect for Christmas time and those wintry, colder months and you just want to be warm and smell something warm. I really love the smell of this one. It's very cinnamony as well. I love cinnamon so gotta love the candle. After buying so much Zoella stuff recently I kind of wanted to dive into Tanya Burr's range. I went and had a look at her Christmas range and I found this cute little guy. <laughs> you know I love burgundy and this is kind of a burgundy purple. It's more, it's more purple than um, red but I really really like this. This was £6 before. When I saw that it had gone down two quid to £4, I was like, yeah, okay, getting it now. I cannot wait to try this out. I'll let you know how I get on with that. That is called Sugar Plum, by the way. So, right in front of me, you're not going to be able to see this, but I'll insert a video. There is a big mirror, <laughs> and I've been wanting a big mirror for um, a while. I used to have this like little one, this about square one, and I put it on the windowsill and, like... It just wasn't big enough, in my opinion. I, I had to get really close to it. I couldn't, I don't know. I just, I love this big mirror. I can see everything. It's so cool. And the other thing I got is this little baby. It is my brush holder. Now this brush holder was from The Range and it's not a brush holder. It's actually a candle holder. And I saw it and I just love this nice copper design with these lovely trees. These brushes are making too much noise. Um, but yeah, I just thought it was really nice. It's perfect for a brush holder and I can fit plenty more brushes in here. Packages. Woo! Okay, that wasn't a good idea. This first one is from Super Drug. As you know, I love my Kate Moss lipsticks. So yes, it's another Kate Moss lipstick. No surprise there. I only have two from the matte range. It's the 107 and the 110. The other day I was wearing my red, my number one Kate Moss, and I was like, oh, I really need a matte, a matte red. So I thought, what the hell, let's just go get the 111. And this is the only one that has a name. This one is called Kiss of Life. A very nice, deep red. I think it's a little bit lighter than the 01, but we'll see. So I already have the Revlon cherries in the snow and Revlon fire and ice. I wanted a deeper darker shade especially since Halloween is coming up. This one I really really like it's called black cherry just like my favorite candle. I'm going to open this for you if I can. Yeah. Come on. Okay there's the lovely Revlon packaging. I love this packaging. I really really do. I don't know why I just, I just do. Here is the very nice black cherry. Look at that deep shade. Now this is the darkest shade I think I own now. It's so deep, it's so dark. Like, yeah, I love it. Okay, so another lipstick that I got, this range I've never tried before. I'm really intrigued, I was really intrigued. It had great reviews on all of their products. In fact, mo in fact, I think everything had a great review on it. 
So this is the packaging. It's Zoeva, nice silver, like a space grey silver. This one is called One Wish. This I have bought specifically for Halloween. I am planning to wear this when I go to Scarefest with my friends Scarlett, Misha and Paige. Oh that's flipping that's gorgeous. <laughs> and the packaging on Oh, I really like that. Where's my, there's my Revlon and there's my Zoeva. But I really like that. I really love the packaging. Oh, that's cute. So it says Color Love Makeup. Oh, it has a lock. I like the fact that it has a lock when it pops up and down, so that's good. And there is the lipstick. That is a nice purple. Oh my gosh, that is stunning. I can't wait to wear this for Halloween. I really can't. I'm going to go for like a vampire-y look deep purple. I don't have any deep purples. Like the 107 is kind of like a, a deep red with a bit of purple. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh guys. Watch this. <laughs> I only just realised. I did hear about this but I only just... Look at that! It's magnetic! It's freaking magnetic! Oh my gosh! I love this! I'm going to be playing with this all day now. I know who would love this. Kate Ellis would love this, I think. Oh my gosh. Oh! <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this. I wore a lipstick, guys. Gosh, I need a life. <laughs> I love the lipsticks. I then went on to ordering some eyeshadows. This one, I was going to buy it from the Mac store, but I think they're about 60. I don't know, maybe lower than that. I saw this on, on eBay for £4 and I think I won it for 6 So let's open this. Ooh, there's some testers in here. What we got? Eye and Lip Contour Complex. Interesting. Another tester. Eye Contour Mask. Reduces fine lines and puffiness. Really? There we go, guys. In this package, we get paper. Fantastic. I want my product. Okay, here we go. I've got it. This one is called Amber Lights. I can't open it. I can't open it. Oh, there we go. So there is the called Amber Lights. I really, really like this. I cannot wait to use this. It's kind of like it's got like a rosy tone to it. I know I love my rose gold, and rose gold is very popular at the minute. But yeah, it's got a nice goldy, rosy sheen to it. Now this next package i am so excited to open there is a makeup range that you can't get in the uk as of yet and it's called ColourPop. now i've heard so many phenomenal reviews so i wanted to try it out for myself next question you're probably going to ask is how the hell did i manage to get ColourPop? because you cannot even order it to the uk so basically i went on my little research hunt and found out that you can ship to the uk using a service which gives you a an american address and then, then you order on Colourpop and send it to this American address. The American address that, the, that this site gives you then will send it on to you. Obviously, you have to pay postage. It's not that expensive. Okay, so Kathleen Lights really loves this Amber Lights eyeshadow. And I could not order from Colourpop's website if I didn't get her eyeshadow collection. Here we go. This is what box looks like colour pop and this spongy stuff Ooh, it's getting everywhere so this is a little card that just basically gives you a tips and tricks on how to do your eyeshadow picture and then you've got the instructions on the back oh that is adorable there's a little note in here oh that's colour pop thank you and then they've handwritten a note on here and it says hi Katie Cocoa puffs are cool, but we are cuckoo for you. Kiss, kiss, colour pop. That's cute. I really like that. That's adorable. I really... Oh, just cute. I love cute things. Okay, so here inside my package, can you see... Oh, pretty things. Oh, pretty beautiful things. So, let's have a look. I'm going to start off with the additional eyeshadows I bought and then go on to the Kathleen Lights eyeshadow. I think this one is Game Face. So that is the little cute box. Made in the USA with a cute little heart. 
adorable. I just love, I just, I really like the packaging. So there's like a purpley packaging inside and then you get this cute little eyeshadow pot. And this one is game face though, that's all good. And this is a very deep gold. It's like almost a bronzy colour. That is game face. This is called Lala. La 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 la, like like the telly tubbies. La la ho. Okay, this is a rose gold. So there is the rose gold. It's really cute. The next colour, this one will be sequin. Again, no guess as to what it is. Oh my gosh, I really love this colour. I think this is my favourite out of the ones I bought. But there is the nice metallic rose gold. On to the Kathleen Lights. As you can see, this is called Where the Light Is. Unlike most um, collections or palettes, this is not actually in a palette. This is for eyeshadows, like this, just in a bigger box. So once you get the box, you pour out the little eyeshadows. So the first one I picked up is Glow, and this is a matte shade. I think this would be a perfect shade for like a base, so you can build these other eyeshadows up on top of it. There it is, Glow. I picked up another matte, and this is called Cornelius. So this is a lovely brown. I like the fact that this is not too deep or dark, but yeah, I'm really liking this, Kathleen. This one's called Blaze. This is definitely a bronze. Really, really pretty. I really like the amount of um, sparkle in this. The glitter's not too thick or big, so it's not going to go everywhere because I cannot stand big glitters. Really, really, really can't, guys. And then the one I've been most excited and anticipated for because it is a solid gold. But I really, really, really like this shade. I cannot wait to use this. It's absolutely gorgeous. I think that's the first time I've actually used gorgeous for this collection. That is it guys, that is my October haul. Let me know if you want any of these products swatched. Thank you for watching this video, please give it a thumbs up, please subscribe to our channel and comment below. I will see you guys next time, so bye! an alarm going off and it's really driving me insane please shh like the fact what just happened <laughs> i don't even know how that even worked i just kind of fell off my chair <laughs> okay so this